filming locations from the Blair Witch Project. Join me, shall you? This is Burkittsville formerly Blair. It is a small, quiet Maryland town. You'll notice the sign looks a lot different. That's because when the movie came out, fans of the movie would come out here and they stole the original signs. So they've changed it. Now it looks like that. This is the cemetery from the, one of the opening shots in the movie where they were doing the dialogue right over in this area here. You can see that road in the background there. So this is the Blair's Witch Cemetery, present day. Here's where the slate would have been when they were trying to do the very first shot. And he said, kiss the slate. Should we all, like, get our fingers open and bleed on it? A little <laughs> bloodletting on the slate? No, we'll save that for later. Kiss it. And then the one guy over here bit the slate. Right there. Put a chow down on the slate. Mikey for a slate. Kiss it. Good luck. Oh, he licked yeah, it. Go. God bless him. Go. Hey, That's slate. supposed to eat it. We need that for the rest of the shoot. You can tell because of this tombstone there. Much like a small, quiet town anywhere. No more than 20 families laid their roots here over 200 years ago, many of whom remain either on this hill or in the town below. Once they left the cemetery, they would have drove straight down that way. You can see those two railings and they were driving that way and they said we got the first shot of the movie they were pretty excited little did they know that they were going to meet up with the Blair Witch or something moving over there in the corn yeah. well we have shot the first scene the cemetery scene the opening is shot it smells like evil come with me over this way see if this looks familiar Looks like all this has been redone, but that pole there, that pole right there is exactly the same in this shot. She's holding the child, telling the story. Two men were out hunting, uh -huh. and they were camped near the cabin or something that she's supposed to haunt. No, uh -huh. no. And they disappeared off the face of the earth. No. Really? Okay, it's all right, Ingrid. I'm just telling a scary story, but it's not true. Awesome. So right over here is where the guy told the story of the seven people who were killed. Finally one day old Mr. Parr come down into the market and said, I'm finally finished. And what did he mean by that? Well, I guess nobody knew at first. On the back side of that tree, you can see part of the house. You can also see those buildings down the road. So right here. And it just was a, a terrible thing. It just tore the whole community up. Here's a little added bonus. Llamas. 
You guys know anything about the Blair Witch? You heard of the Blair Witch? What do you know about the Blair Witch? Nothing? They don't know anything. Right over here, this might look familiar. This is another spot where they walked in. The sign on the door said 19800. The guy would have walked straight through there. The ghost would have been right there. The camera would have panned like this. Yeah, the tree there is torn down. It would have been all the way up. She would have been sitting right there. Halloween time is a creepy enough phenomenon. I don't think, tell me a little I don't want to go about... cheesy. I want to really avoid any cheese. I want to present this in as straightforward a way as possible, and I think the legend is unsettling enough. This is the hotel that they would have stayed in in one of these rooms here, right through these windows. Okay, we're gonna do um, an equipment check, but I'm gonna call my mom. Okay, I've got a bag of oxen and beer. And we don't really need to get that. <laughs> so I, I guess you're covered then. Is where they would have got drunk and prepared for their mission into the woods. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good, thank you. Okay. Here I go. Drink, drink! This hotel is now abandoned. Hey. How are you? I'm hurting. Some serious woods we're heading into. Are you excited? You got it. They would have drove straight down this way, right towards Coffin Rock. Off in the woods, you can see this little shack. Witch Shack. They would have got their bags and their things all together, loaded up. They would have had their vehicle parked right over there. Wow. Oh my God, this is a very heavy. Right here is where the fishermen were fishing, they were casting their lines out on this little river. Right out of the water. Right out of the water. Near Up the, the side of the tree and it disappeared over them. Oh, okay. you're full of it. And there was an older guy over here that she asked permission if she could film. In fact, the way you can tell, not only by the rocks, but over here, if you pan the camera, you can see that bridge right there. What did you say, sir? Uh, first of all, can I have your permission to put your image on video for the purposes of the documentary entitled The Blair Witch Project? We're going to continue on and see if we can find Coffin Rock. Lots of spiders out in this neck of the woods. I think we have discovered Coffin Rock. Right over there, across the waterway, is the cave and Coffin Rock. Let's see if we can get over to it. See if we can cross over that tree down there. You want to go back and forth? You can do it that way. I don't want to do this at all, but okay. Well, let's do. We'll, yeah, we'll do it back and forth. Oh, oh what'd you drop? No, I didn't drop it. Oh. Wallet chain stuck. Dang, money's holding me back. All right, here we go. Here, let me just toss this to you. Yeah, yeah. All right, you. here, back, throw it, go up, jump up there a little bit more. Farther, farther up, I'd rather hit the ground. Than, okay, cool. <laughs> so we made it up to Coffin Rock. Pretty secluded out here, it was very difficult. Very difficult to get across this waterway. We had to climb across that tree, which I think that might be the tree they use, who knows. That's the cave that she read the intro about the Blair Witch. On top of the rock formation, the story of the torture inflicted upon these brave five men unfolded. 
Upon return, vultures were seen at the rock. But upon inspection, the bodies had been removed by persons unknown. The search party claimed that the stench of death was still thick, and whomever had taken the bodies had done so in a matter of hours. Boy, look at this. Someone's actually got some sticks back there making a cross. That happened here at Coffin Rock. Where's that witch? The Blair Witch. Is that her? No. Coffin Rock. So out here in this wooded area is supposedly where the Blair Witch House is. Where the final scene from the Blair Witch was filmed. Yeah. Definitely a lot of rubble here left. Could have been right here. It's really hard to tell. Somewhere in this wooded area. No way of really knowing though. I guess the Blair Witch wins. The Blair Witch wins. The Blair Witch wins. Subscribe.